We sat down with the cast of Hamari Aduri Kahani, Vidya Balan, and Imran Hashmi for a fun, heartfelt chat. Check it out. Hi guys, I'm Nafisa. That's Imran Hashmi, Vidya Balan, and they are here to talk about the movie Hamari Aduri Kahani. And by the way, we're watching 9 XC the show. Let's talk a bit about the movie Hamari Aduri Kahani. Just the crux of what the film suggests, Hamari Aduri Kahani. I think we all have, at some point of time, had that bittersweet feeling uh, when we are in love with someone. Um, you know. Every relationship comes with angst, pain. Uh, you can't wish that away. Uh, we've all had, you know, times when we've had certain tragedies in our life, and that brings us closer to people that we love. So I think that's how I think I would I would pitch the film. It's your first with the Bhat camp. Yes, it is. <laughs> Excited? Uh, yeah, I have been for a while now since I got the offer, because I'd never imagined I'd actually uh, get an offer to do um, Vishesh Films film. Because the kind of films that I've been doing and the kind of films that they've been making are completely different. But uh, I'm glad these scenes that you were performing were very emotionally and very emotionally powerful or strong. So when you went back to your vanity, did you were you did you have that feeling? Oh God, someone yeah. actually went through these moments. Yeah, uh, you know there are lots of powerful scenes in this film, and they were uh, extremely intense. But surprisingly, I came out of the film. I'm feeling not drained. Credit for that really goes to Mohit. You know, I think he knows how to handle actors. The way he gently pushes us to deliver, to get what he wanted, but we never felt the pressure. When, when, when you do a film like this, um, you know, we were very, very nervous, all of us. But between shots, I think Mohit pulled his hair out because I think we were generally, most of the time, we were laughing and giggling and, and just gossiping about things. But I think I realized when I look back at that, it was actually too. Uh, hurl ourselves out and diffuse yeah. the tension on the set because we knew we could not continuously feel an intense emotion. So you have to be there in the zone when you're in front of the camera, right. but have to be you know completely switch off. Are you worried? Your previous movie did not do very well, Mr. X. Yeah. Are you worried for this movie? Thoda sa to you must be nervous, huh? No, I don't. No. Um, I I guess I'm a very different kind of animal. I uh, don't get I don't gloat when I have a success. I don't whine when I have a failure. I think for me, life is in the journey. No one starts off making a film saying that, you know, today I'm going to make a film that's not going to work at the box office. We all make films, but it's like you take a swing at it and sometimes, you know, good things happen. Sometimes it just kind of in, in its own way gets probably rejected. I think this film uh, for me, um, I, I'm, I'm honestly saying this, I've, I've really got, uh, I'm very content with the way we've all, you know, been through this journey of making this film. Let's talk about the music. I love the title track. I, I love think it. Too. Everyone loves the title track. Yeah. So that's your favorite song. Absolutely the favorite because uh, I think it describes um, the story of the film so beautifully. You know, I've seen when Amari Dhri Ghani's when the when the lyrics were written, uh, I've seen the lyricist uh, sit next to Bhatsab's feet and he Bhatsab's narrating the film and he was literally moved to tears and he was writing now, he's penning something, he rushed out and I think that's when it came from his yeah. heart, yeah. Alright then, so that was Imran Hashmi and Vithya Baland. Alright guys, mwah.